It's been extremely hot out these days. You know what that means. It's the summer. Well, it's not summer on the other side of the earth. Then again, I don't know where the other side of the earth is. From this exact location. Huh. Wish I had a map. Okay. I wish I had an atlas. Okay. I wish I had a globe. Okay. I wish I had a porn star. No? Mm. All right, so directly below me is, well, actually, directly below me really is my living room. <laughs> <laughs> Directly below me is, uh, on the other side of the earth, uh, Jacksonville, is the Indian Ocean. F -f 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 Factoid of the day. So to all those Indian Oceaners out there, this video does not pertain to you because it's the summer here, but not the summer over there. Wait, this video is really not about the summer. It's more about the bikes. And this video still doesn't pertain to you because I'm sure in the Indian Ocean, you don't need a bike to get around. Am I right or am I right? To tell you the truth, I don't even know why I'm still pretending that Indian Oceaners exist. <laughs> I'm such a moron. And I really don't know why I did a theatrical shot to the head kind of thing. But it was sort of cool, right? No. Nope. It's the summer, and a lot of people are riding bikes these days. And if you ride a bike long enough, you'll be a victim of SBS, also known as sweaty butt syndrome. But that's okay, that's all right. Everybody sweats, even in that moist crevice area. And pause it right there. Did anybody else catch that? After I said moist crevice area, I licked my lips. <laughs> now, I'm not sure why I did that, because I wasn't even talking about the good moist crevice area. That's right, kids. When you grow up, you'll begin to realize that there is such a thing as a good moist crevice area. It's called the vagina. So there was this one time when I was walking to school and this guy passes me on his bike. Zoom. It didn't bother me at the time, until he went to go lock his bike. That's when I got an eyeful of buttocks and SBS. And it didn't help that he was wearing light skin clothing. I can't even explain to you what I saw. It was something worse than SBS. It was ALS, anal leakage syndrome. That's right, the stain was brown and runny. Have fun with that image, alright?
But seriously, anybody who rides a bike nowadays should probably invest in something like a diaper. You know, one, because it's good hygiene, and two, because it saves you from embarrassment, especially from a random guy who talks about you on the internet. This guy. Now, I don't know what these diapers actually look like, but if I were to pick one, I would probably go with an astronaut's diaper. Now, judging from the news and the media and movies, you know, astronauts are pretty cool and badass. Now, whatever the astronaut's diaper is, I'm pretty sure it's pretty badass themselves. Just don't go driving halfway across the country to try to kill somebody who's trying to steal your lover. Did anybody else catch that? I was referring to the whole Lisa Nowak and that whole NASA thing back in 2007. Anybody remember that? No? All right. Oh, one more thing. Remember that guy that I was talking about with that SBS, AALS, PMS thing that zoomed by me? Remember when I said I didn't mind? It's because we were on a pathway. Now, this whole thing would have gone down differently had this been a sidewalk. You see, I would have been walking in my normal pace and he would have been right behind me on his bicycle realizing that he can't get around me because the path is too narrow. So he would have been like this. Oh yeah, you know what this is. And if you don't, pay attention to the sound. Bring, 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 bring. Oh yeah, his superior bell. But seriously though, why bring, bring me, huh? Why bring, bring me, bro? This is called the sidewalk. Not the side cycle. So on a side note to all those cyclists out there who use their superior bells to pedestrians, if you ever bring, bring me, I will bring, bring it. I swear to God, the next time I hear a bring, bring me behind me, I don't care who you are or how old you are, I'm gonna start throwing elbows around and I'm gonna start doing Zangief style clotheslines till I crack you in the jaw. And once you're off your bike, I'm going to grab your hair and your face and I'm going to stick into the gearing system and I'm going to take the pedal and I'm going to start hitting you with it and it's going to, your hair is going to get all mangled into the whole uh, chains and the, and the whole wheel and everything like that and then it's going to get so tight that your scalp is just going to rip open and then there's just going to be blood profusely shooting up in the sky and then it's going to rain blood all over me and I'm going to be like ha 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 bring 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 who's the superior now bitch Yes, it's true. I'm violent. Arf! Yes, I am shooting a video. You ruined my video!